I'm just here to do my job. On Saturday morning, Jeffrey Berman walked into his Manhattan office vowing to keep working as one of America's highest profile federal prosecutors. By late afternoon, he was replaced by a presidential order. In between came the end of a dramatic battle between Berman, the U.S. Attorney for the Southern District of New York, and William Barr, the U.S. Attorney General. Berman refused to step down Friday after Barr issued a surprise statement announcing Berman had resigned, a move Berman said never happened. On Saturday afternoon, Barr sent a letter to Berman saying that because he'd refused to step down, the president had fired him and replaced him with an assistant U.S. attorney. Berman is an experienced federal prosecutor and former defense attorney. He's also an active Republican. He donated $5,400 to President Trump's campaign in 2016, worked on the president's transition team, and was a former law partner of Trump lawyer Rudy Giuliani. Berman was first appointed to the influential position of U.S. attorney in 2018, after his predecessor, Preet Bharara, was fired after he refused to resign. The same thing has now happened to Berman. After initial concerns over his past associations with Trump, Berman continued the Southern District's tradition of independence. Politics does not enter into our decision-making on uh, charging a case. We bring a case when the case is ready to be brought. The office has overseen prosecutions of high-profile figures in Trump's orbit, including his former lawyer, Michael Cohen, Representative Chris Collins, and two associates of Giuliani. Friday night, Berman said our investigations will move forward without delay or interruption. All this comes as the Trump administration is actively removing government employees who have investigated and prosecuted Trump officials. Independent counsels have been removed from federal agencies. Federal prosecutors have alleged meddling from Barr in cases against Trump's former national security advisor Michael Flynn and campaign advisor Roger Stone. Trump has been considering removing Berman since at least the middle of 2018, two sources tell CNN. And now Berman is out of a job. Trump fired him, but told reporters the ouster was Barr's call. That's his department, not my department. Uh, but we have a very capable attorney general, so that's really up to him. I'm not involved.